Okay, all right. <laughs> the things we do for YouTube. Ow. Hey, what's going on, everybody? Rob here. <laughs> Back from the dead. I got myself a, uh, a coffin. As you can see, if you're wondering how this got here, I suggest you head on over to the Simply Nail Logical channel. Christine, she likes to like uh, order large, obscure objects to our home and then leave them here for us to deal with, which is what we're looking at today. A 200 pound coffin here in my basement. I'm gonna try to spend 24 hours in this joint. Speaking of rectangular boxes and square-ish kind of spaces, this episode is being brought to you and sponsored by Square Space. Boom! God, did you see how I did that? Just so... That's right, us and the Square, we go way back. It's awesome that they've stuck around to still support such death-defying content such as this. You, you got it with the death-defying? I hope so. I spent a lot of time on that joke. But let's get down to it. What you probably want to see is the actual coffin itself. Have you ever seen a coffin up close? Because this is weird. Okay. Ah, all right, well, there it is. Uh, that is the hollow casket, which just defiles the house and anywhere that it sits with, with hollow glitter. This is where, where you are laid to rest forever. This pillow, it's got a lot of support. Not that that matters, you know what I mean? This is what disturbs me the most. This is, I guess, what you could say, the mattress? This is not a lot of support. It opens up uh, over here. Plenty of leg room. I got a bag of stuff. I'll show you what I got in here. Couple lights. Uh, we got a couple beers in here. This is a peanut butter jelly time. This is gonna be delicious. Some chips. A couple <laughs> magazines. Oh, uh, and you know, another one of me. In case I need somebody to talk to. I got some pee bags. And most importantly, I've got my phone in case I need any help in, in case of an emergency or something. I should be fine. Everything should be good. Now, obviously, as you can see, I'm in my basement. You will not find me digging a six foot hole in my backyard. That is way too much work. So instead, uh, I bought bags of both soil and rock, which uh, will be placed on top of the coffin whilst I am in it. And since Corinne wanted absolutely nothing to do with this project whatsoever, I've had to enlist the help of Curtis, uh, our editor who works here with us in the Threadbanger Studios to uh, to help me out. So uh, Curtis, everybody. Hello. We are gonna be in contact via phone. Curtis comes in here every day to help edit the show. So tomorrow when you come back, I'll be ready to be taken out. What I need you to do, however, is close me in, get the rocks and the soil, put them on top. Okay. Are you sure? Yeah, as long as you got your phone f charged. All right, let's do this. All right. Ah! <laughs> oh, wait, sorry. I gotta bring the camera with me. Okay, here we go. Oh. Okay, hold on. Let me get the lights on in here. Okay. But don't don't let me out. No matter how much I scream and how much I pound. What the f Jesus. Rice. Okay, it's getting hot in here already. <laughs> Itchy and scratchy. <laughs> okay, all right. Just gotta relax. Just gotta hang out. <laughs> Is that it? All right, I'm gonna try to push up. I can't even get the leverage to open it up with my feet. All right, Rob, I've got my phone. Just uh, give me a call. If Wait, do I have problems. my phone? Oh, sh okay, I got it. But I do warn you, my battery is at 20%. Don't, well, just make sure you charge your battery then. I lost my charger. <laughs> Good luck, Rob. Okay. I'll see you tomorrow. I'll see you tomorrow. Keep that phone charged there. All right. And that's it. We're in a f***ing coffin. All right. <laughs> Pretty quality craftsmanship, I'm into it. That's kind of nice to look at. Pretty comfy. It's hot in here. Starting to get a little bit claustrophobic. Oh, <sighs> Woo! Holy shit. give me a better fucking pillow. It would probably be best to take off this jacket before we even start anything. Oh, <laughs> oh God, really tight in here. Oh, me, God damn it. <laughs> All right, I got the jacket off. Whew. Okay, that's cool, I'm cool. <laughs> We're back. Let's take a little bit of water. Mm. I didn't really think about the oxygen situation in here. Just need some air circulation. 
<sighs> All right, like I was trying to convince myself of, there's plenty of room in here just to hang out in. There's some pretty good things in here. Is there some chili and lime pork cracklings? Oh yeah, pretty solid. What else we got in here? Have you seen these? A chip made out of, of chicken, a chicken chip. Mm. Get that beer going over here. Here we go. Mm. I mean, this is the afterlife, you know what I mean? Mmm, cheers. What else we got in this little bag here? Here we got a couple magazines, food and wine, some yoga, glamour. But the one I'm most excited for over here, we got the uh, little smut lies. Secrets. Hello. Give me the tea. Oh, this is my favorite one. Stars. They're just like us. Holy shit. Is that J-Lo? She's wearing a pair of jeans on each pair of legs that is really something oh oh holy all right that's a lot of information oh who wore it best who do you think who do you think she won she rocked it although i like the hairdo hey hermione damn meg you f***ed up what the f is going on with the beebs. Ooh, let's see what my horoscope is. A connection with someone at work can be supportive. I believe that because if Curtis doesn't come back soon, I don't know what's gonna happen. I mean, that's really how you gotta do this thing. Prepare yourself. I got my phone here. I plugged that in. That's got plenty of life. What is that? Where is that? Boom, phone battery. Oh, f I spent too much time f around those all these apps. I didn't even start a timer. How long have we been in here? An hour, two hours already? What else have I got in here? A little radio. Oh, I gotta f wind it up. Oh, this thing doesn't even get any reception in this f tin box bullshit. Wait, hold on, hold on, hold on. Something coming in here. Oh, so close. Oh, sh we got something. F it's country music. Oh, f yeah, this angle is really bad. I have like four f chins over here. <sighs> We're going on two and a half hours in this thing. Real boring in here. If I kick the bottom open, I can kind of get like a little bit of air in here. Ooh. Ah! I got a cramp! I got a cramp! I got a cramp! Ah! Yeah, this is so f***ing terrible. Maybe I can do that, that Kill Bill thing. How did she f***ing do that? Oh, God, it hurts my elbow. Maybe if I just like go to sleep, that'll f***ing kill some time. I'm not I'm tired. It's not like I'm f***ing tired in a goddamn coffin. What else is in this f***ing bag? Pork rinds. It would suck if I like choked on one of these in here. These are the kind of things that I like to think about while I lay in a coffin. What do I do? I just drive. Because I just wipe it on here. I don't know. Look at this. Hey, we're on a GoPro now. Oh, a fortune cookie. You will attain the highest levels of intelligence. <laughs> Talk about getting the wrong fortune cookie, am I right? As I lay in a coffin oh, with bags of rocks on top. <laughs> How much longer am I in this box for? How much longer am I in this box for? How much longer am I in this box for? Oh, here we go. Got a harmonica here. Figured I could play the blues while I'm dead, you know? <laughs> My name is Rob Zong. <laughs> I'm the coolest mother around. <laughs> Laying inside this hollow coffin, <coughs> pretending like they put me in the ground. I've got the <coughs> demonetization blues, baby. I got the YouTube blues. Yeah. Oh, f that was something. Oh, it's so hot in here. Oh, it's tight. <coughs> oh my God, it's only f 218. F bullshit. What can you do for f YouTube videos? I got a. Pee real bad. I've got a f***ing pack! So I got this, these Ziploc bags, which is really the only thing that I could pee in, but I don't know what the f*** I was thinking. What am I supposed to put my f***ing dick in here and pee into it? I don't know! Oh god, I don't know what to think. I gotta like, lean over to the side or something. Okay, and then just pee into the bag. That's cool. Oh, I can't go when you're watching! Here we go. Oh god. Oh yeah. Just peeing into a bag in a coffin. This is great content. That's enough. Jesus Christ. Bag full of piss over here. Well, that happened. Woo! That feels a lot better.
in this bag we also brought. Oh, this is a good one. This is a book that I made for Corinne for our first anniversary. This is our first year together. I've never even shown this to anybody. That is uh, mine and Corinne's first Halloween right here, October 31st. I went as a uh, as a dead Enron executive. This is us in Key West when we were just babies. This is us in Amsterdam, us standing in front of a, uh, you know, just a giant penis. We did Paris that year. We went to London, apparently. I don't remember any of this. These are the cherry blossoms in Washington, D.C. Check out that f hairdo. Burning Man. Do you want to see some f***ing pictures? Ooh, little nipple right there. Is that me? Whoa, hello. Demonetized. Good times. Good times. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, all right, all right. Put that away. Holy s***. Is that 4.56 yesterday or is that still today? That's f***ing crazy. The thing that worries me the most is that there's like no oxygen in this thing. Like I could like like taste the same air over and over again and it just gets like thicker with like pork rinds and chicken chips. And I need more water. Oh f this is such a dumb idea. Alright, I'm gonna try to take just a little nap in here for a little while, so I'll see you uh hopefully back in a little bit. No. Oh. oh that's creepy. The little GoPro light. It's really quite nice in here. It's very quiet. I'm like kind of digging this box, I'm not going to lie. I'm still in this coffin. Huh. Okay. Okay, I need to get out now. Oh, it's so hot in here. Ah! How long have we been in here? I think I it's think been days. days. It feels like it's been days. What are we gonna do? I didn't sign up for this. Have you been in here the entire time with me? Are you sure are you you've been, been in here the entire time? What? 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 There's somebody here. Who? Huh? Curtis! 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 <laughs> okay. It's over, buddy. You made it. Oh, God. I need some water. Oh. Okay. I'll be right back with some water. Oh. Holy s***. Oh god, my back. Oh, we f***ing did it. It wasn't 24 hours, I don't think. I'll tell you what, I may keep this thing around for a little bit longer. I can vampire the s*** out of this coffin, you know what I mean? You need some place to relax, you need some place to read, maybe snack out, you know? A little sensory deprivation or something? Maybe you just need some place to scream. This is the place. My brain may uh, be suppressing all the terrible things that happened in here. I may have to check the footage, I'm not sure. In the meantime, a huge shout out to our sponsor, Squarespace. Like I said, we've been using Squarespace for years. Threadbanger.com was built on it. I actually built Threadbanger.com, which just shows you how simple and easy it is to use. If you wanna help support the channel, be sure that you head on over to Squarespace to start your free trial. And when you're ready to launch the site, be sure that you hit up squarespace.com slash Rob You do that and they're gonna give you 10% off your first website or domain. That's right, you can also get domains there. It's almost 2019. People, if you don't have a website already, come on, get with the program. How do you like this hair, by the way? I like how this is looking, huh? Talk about bedhead, more like deadhead, am I right? <laughs> That's why they sponsor this channel. Do me a favor, like up this video, even if you didn't. I'm not gonna tell anybody. If you got any, uh, you know, suggestions or ideas for what to do with this coffin next, uh, maybe besides burying my career in it, be sure to leave those down in the comments below. And I'll see you around here next time.